Hello, Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. And welcome, Cross Watchers. I'm going to take a look at your connection with you and your person and what you can expect for love in December. So this is for Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs in love for December. So what is passing them? Religious factors. Your love life is influenced by your religious upbringing and spiritual path. Okay. What is this person's energy towards Scorpio? Honeymoon. Enjoy the bliss of holiday time together. What is Scorpio's energy towards this person? Heart-to-heart -heart conversations. Honestly, discuss your feelings with each other and the external influence here. Express your love. Go ahead and make the romantic gesture. What is the outcome? What is the outcome in December? Codependency addictions are affecting your romantic life. Okay. All right. So, in your past, I see as though somebody has been really guarded. Somebody has a lot of trust issues when it comes to relationships, when it comes to new people even, or when it comes to past people as well here. And this has all happened because of karmic connections. And I see that now um, somebody has been wanting to do things the right, the right way um, in a tr more traditional way with this person that you're possibly still dealing with or will be dealing with. And it looks like there's light at the end of the tunnel for you guys with the star card. Um, you've been going, the worst is over, okay? The worst is over. Um, you're going through a, per a period of regeneration and healing and really nurturing yourself at this point. And following the guidance of spirituality for some of you and going through a major awakening. I feel as though um, you meeting somebody in particular in your past has triggered an awakening within you and there's been a lot of clarity and insight and I feel as though um, you're starting to move in, you're starting to get your groove back. You're starting to move into a place of confidence and independence and asserting yourself and being communicative and really speaking your truth and really just being a boss at this point here because you're, you're, you, the worst is over and you're allowing new beginnings to really form your connections in a way that will be healthy so that's some really good energy that is passing you tell me about honeymoon page of wands so somebody is coming in here to communicate with you news of passion and somebody feeling a spark somebody traveling I do see somebody traveling towards you in in December and communication coming in in December here from possibly it could be an Aquarius or it could be a fire sign Leo Aries Sagittarius here and it looks like this is somebody who has um, not moved on from you who um, this is somebody for some of you um, this is somebody who has rejected you or maybe you rejected them who is wanting to come in and communicate wanting uh, another chance and wanting you to really judge the situation and make a decision. But 
yeah for some of you this is somebody who could have rejected you who has taken a look taken a look at this offer that you've been wanting and really um, making a final decision here whether or not they want to take this cup of love that has been given and I do see really good news coming in here so it looks very positive um, coming from your person's side and if um, you're in a relationship and maybe um, you have been feeling like you haven't been getting that much attention or you've been feeling like they have been a little bit disinterested I see a re-spark in this connection for you guys tell me about heart-to-heart -heart conversations so queen of wands fire again I feel as though again you're starting to assert yourself you're starting to get back into this energy and you really do care about this person and you want to communicate your feelings you want to talk about what do you want to talk about what is this heart to heart conversation about judgment okay so i feel like you really want to talk about the root issue of this connection um, that you're currently dealing with or when this person comes in I feel like you're going to communicate the root issue of um, I feel like you've been in your feelings possibly when it comes to this person possibly from your past who is coming back in because we do have judgment here on wanting another chance and I definitely feel like you're getting to the root issue and you're really starting to express yourself and express what you've been feeling and how you feel like you've been affected in this situation here when it comes to your emotions mom you do really care about this person and I do feel like you're going to end up communicating your feelings to them as well here and there's a lot of reflecting that is going on okay a lot of reflection tell me about express your love two of swords so there's been indecision um there's been some indecision possibly uh capricorn Virgo or Taurus here who they I feel like somebody has been found out when it comes to their true feelings here so somebody found out how somebody truly feels like and this can be through tarot this can be um, maybe a friend ended up telling you or somebody ended up spilling the fact that um, somebody loves the other person here and it looks like a, it could be a masculine a masculine earth sign here who has been found out about um, their heart's true desires here and it's caused them it's caused them to have to make a decision here whether or not they come forward now and give this offer and really be there be mature and be serious towards this connection here i'm hearing i'm hearing like somebody just wasn't ready like this person wasn't ready for for the other person to know that soon how they felt tell me about codependency Okay, so, okay, okay, so in your outcome, Seven of Cups here, I definitely see that there's a lot of choices, a lot of options that you can go with. There's a lot of different routes that you can take with this person or different people in general. I feel like you have options in December. Um... You have an option and a decision to make on who it is that you want to 
move forward with and move into union with and a partnership with and I feel as though I also see somebody who's been in and out of your life who has been kind of a player I see them coming in and being one of your options and communicating that they want to make things happen they want to work things out and they want to move into this um, partnership and union with you but the thing is the thing is is that this person who has been kind of in and out of your life is not going to be stable okay I'm getting that out of all of these options and choices um, somebody is just not stable for something serious even if this is something they're wanting in the moment it's something that they're expressing in the moment they want in the moment but it once the spark just like fades then they're out the door just as fast as they came in here so um, be discern use your discernment because there's a lot of different options a lot of different people here if this isn't you um, this is the other person who who has other options in this situation and they're wanting to manifest a soulmate connection here and really communicate the fact that they want a relationship um, again making a decision needing to make a decision out of all of these options here so I don't see that a decision has been made yet but I do see that in December there's progression things are moving forward towards um, un union and partnership here so maybe in like January who knows is there anything else that we need to know about this connection and love for Scorpio union yeah decision somebody's kind of indecisive in December about union but they know they need they need to make a decision soon Ooh, in your outcome though there is true love a love that will last a lifetime so I if it doesn't happen in December I really feel like 2021 is like the year for you um, or soon like January even or maybe even towards the end of the month for you guys here uh, everybody's in their own kind of timeline but we have children so somebody could have children I feel like in the past like your love life just hasn't been to its like truest potential um, somebody has been single for a very long time for some for somebody out there it could even be years I'm hearing and now they're starting to see the light at the end of the tunnel and I feel like right now like um, things are just kind of up in the air or maybe you're literally in an open relationship right now and you're exploring other people so let's get some more cards is there anything else that we need to know is there anything else that we need to know Okay, improving health and abundance. So I do think, I see things improving. The health of your relationships will be improving and abundance is on its way An abundance of love and abundance of everything I'm getting. Abundance is assured for you guys. It's just a matter of time and there's no need to worry. Okay, so that's what I'm getting for you guys. If you like this reading, Please comment, like, and subscribe, and hit the notification bell so you can be updated for future videos. Let me know if it resonated, and I hope that you found guidance and clarity in your situation. Thank you for watching. Bye.